Uh, which is annoying. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. <laughs> well, what is up, guys? Dan K Memes here, and we are back with our week three APA Wi Fi battle against, uh, which should be Jock, uh, the coach of the dumb firm, the Noons. Um, but it is uh, against his assistant coach, uh, Joe Battles, uh, who is on Team Memes in the APA Showdown, if you didn't know. Um, and it's gonna be it's gonna be an interesting game because I w I was prepped to play Jock, um, and Jock typically we have very intense games, and I was kind of psyched up for it, but Jock has pulled out at the last minute, uh, not last minute, but today, you know, um, uh, he knew he couldn't battle, so uh, Joe has stepped in in his place for this week. Uh, so hopefully Jock will be back with us um, starting for next week, I suppose. But uh, you can see the team that we've brought here. We've got Miltank, uh, a Scarf, Garchomp, um, I think just a regular leftovers kind of bulky Togekiss, uh, a substituting uh, Scrafty, um, Electros, and our Cloister. And it's an interesting team because we've left a lot of uh, left. Uh, we've left our Mega Blasters out, our Ferrothorn, or things like Nido King, uh, which all typically do a lot. But his oh, an error. An error has occurred. An error has occurred. Okay, so we are back. So, yeah, as I was saying, um, I think kind of uh, the the biggest threats on his team, obviously the, the Mega Gallade and the Weavile, it's just a very scary offensive core. So, um, we're just going to try and negate that as much as possible. We have we have Miltank uh, to kind of set up some hazards. Uh, Skarmory is going to be an issue because it does wall uh, Garchomp completely. Um, we do have, uh, I think we have Stone Edge, which probably hits it. I think it hits it for the most damage, obviously, neutrally. Um... But uh, the team that we think he's going to bring is the Mega Gallade, the Weavile, the Skarmory, the Haxorus, the Decidueye, because Jock loves Decidueye, and Gastrodon. So uh, we'll see how many of the, oh god, how many of these we get right. Um, and what we'll have to do, please select Participate in Pokemon. So we see uh, almost bang, oh hello, no Haxorus, Sil Valley and Type Null. Interesting, interesting. Right, okay, so let's... Uh, Let's trade these out on, on the screen here. Type null comes. This thing is bulky. This thing it could will end up being an issue for us. No gastrodon, which is nice. Um, no gastrodon, which is nice. Uh, where is the Sil Valley? There you are. Oh god, you're a big boy, aren't you? Let's shrink you down a little bit. Um. So looking at his team, I think is is lead. He probably leads Skarmory. He probably leads Skarmory. Uh, so in which case, I think I'm just going to lead Electros, and I can kind of get a free, um, a free Volt switch off. That's what I'm going to go for. Uh, lead, lead Electros. Uh, leftovers, leftovers. Uh, our White Herb, Chelsea Cloister, <laughs> Mago Berry, uh, Scrafty, and our Choice Scarf Garchomp. Now looking at this team, it's it's going to be. I don't really have any real strategy. I'm not feeling too confident about the sort of the matchup in general. Um, I didn't have a lot of time to really go through and prep. I kind of just ran um, what I thought what I thought could do work, um, and we'll we'll see how it goes. We'll see how it goes, guys. We are one on one, um, so oh wait, my uh, my mons don't have nicknames. Some of them don't, anyway. Oh no. Oh well. Um, so <laughs> we'll lead the Electros. I predict him to lead the Skarmory, but we'll see. We'll see. We lead Electros, and he sends out the Sil Valley. So we can see that it, that is ice or water. Is that ice or water? I'm not really sure. This this will tell. This will show us. So uh, this Volt Switch here. Okay, it tells us that it's super effective. So it is water. So it's Sil Valley water. Still Valley, Water, Mega Gallade, Weavile, Skarm, Type Null, and Decidueye. So Still Valley, Water. So this is a nice lead for us. Um, and I can just go for a Volt Switch here. I can just go for a Volt Switch. Um, and he should, he should switch out. He should switch out. Um, I think best switching would be for him to go into Decidueye. Obviously, it does, it does take a lot of what I want to go for. Uh, he goes to the parting shops. So that's fine. 
That's fine. So our vault, our vault switch won't do too much. Our vault switch won't do too much. So we see the parting shot there. Parting shot. Um, I see what he wants to go out into. He goes out into the Sigilize. So yeah, it won't do too much. Um, but we can. So that did absolutely nothing. Yeah, that's fine. Um, let's bring out the Sigilize. Level 50. Uh, now looking at my team. Looking at my team. I think I could just go out into Togekiss here. Because Air Slash does a lot. Air Slash does a lot. I can just get a, th a free Thunder Wave off. Nothing he wants to go through does that much to me. So I'm just going to go into Togekiss. I can get a free Thunder Wave off on something. Uh, I predict him to go into the Skarmory. So if we, even if we get a Paralyze on, off on the Skarmory, that would be nice. So we see Leftovers on the Decidueye. <sighs> right. So I, I do predict him to go into Skarmory here. I do predict him to go into Skarmory. Um, or he could go into Type Null. Either way, I'm happy to I'm happy to Thunder Wave. I think I'm happy to Thunder Wave. We are in a nice posi position right now. We are in a nice position right now. And he does withdraw. Do we see the Skarmory? Type now. The Type now comes out. That's fine. And that is now Paras. If we, as long as we hit. Yep. Uh, <laughs> Togekiss is not blind this week. Um, so we don't get to see. It, it will be a, a, obviously a very bulky Type Null set. Um, type Null. Either like Battle Arm, especially defensive at level 50. An air slash does about 20%. Um, I don't really know what he wants to go for on me. He could go for a toxic, perhaps. He could go for a toxic, so. I mean, I'm kind of tempted to go into Scrafty. Because. Uh, wait, do I have Shed Skin or do I have. Oh, no, I have Intimidate. I have Intimidate. Um, I really don't want to get toxic on this thing. Um, I don't want to get Toxic. I didn't... This is why I should have had Ferrothorn. But it does just invite in Mega Gallade. That's why I didn't bring Ferrothorn this week. Because I know Mega Gallade can just set up on me big time. Um, what does the other guy want to do? Not a lot. What does... Okay, let's, let's actually have a look. Mill Tank. Uh, the other guy. Uh, Body Slam does nothing as well. So we can't... We can't even be going for that, really. Um, I might just I might just go for power flinch to be honest. There's no reason not to, as I say, unless he gets the toxic off. Uh, he's he was yeah we we okay, so we air slash we should get power flinch we should like realistically. Uh, if we get the flinch, and um. Now do he could go into Skarmory, so I'm tempted to I'm tempted to go for the double paralysis, uh the double thunder wave. Um, but as I said, I don't want to get toxic. But nothing on my team really wants to get toxic. So I'm just going to go for another air slash. I think he will switch out. I think he will switch out. But um, so I don't. I don't like this thing, and I want to. I want to make it. I want to force it down because whilst it's at so much health, I'm pretty sure it does wall um, cloister. I'm pretty sure it does wall my cloister. Yeah, he stays in again, so that's good. This is good stuff. Do we get the flinch again? He uses rock slide. Let's see how much this does. Not a lot. The lefties will bring bring us up a bit. Um, and I am. I'm looking at it. I wonder how well Garchomp switches in right now. 
A custom set Garchomp. Nah, he doesn't do enough. He doesn't do enough. Um, so I'm gonna I'm gonna go for another. I don't know. I don't know. I think he'll switch out now. I really think he'll switch out now. I think he'll go into Skarmory. Um, my cat. <laughs> it's being a little shit. Uh, thinking about. It, I think he'll go into Skarmory, but at the same time, I don't want to Thunder Wave and risk it. But you know, it's these players that win your games. So I'm gonna go for the Thunder Wave. I'm gonna go for the Thunder Wave. And I'm just going to quickly let my cat out. Because he is being a little shit. <laughs> Go on. Out you get. Out you get. Ho, ho, ho. Here we go. <laughs> right. Uh, still hasn't chosen. Uh, please switch out. Go on. Make me a god. Make me a god. He does withdraw. Show me the Weevil. Show me the Weevil. Yes. Come on. No! This game! Oh! This is not on! That is not fair! That is not fair, man. If we had got that power on that Weavile, that would have been clutch. That would have been so clutch. Because now we're in trouble. Because now we are in trouble. Oh man, where's my Togekiss set gone? Um, an Air Slash would have done a lot as well. Like, it would have done over half. Oh, right, now, the question is, does he attack me or does he go for a Swords Dance? <sighs> does he attack me or does he go for a Swords Dance? I don't think he can risk setting up. I don't think he can risk setting up. Because a Dazzling Gleam does kill. So I am going to switch out. And can I just go into Cloister? Can I just go into Cloister? Um, if he knock offs, that does a lot. If he does just go for the Icicle Crash, then it does nothing. What about Mill Tank? I've got about 20 seconds to choose. Uh, Mill Tank can take. Two hits, so there's no reason not to go into Mill Tank. Uh, he doesn't pursuit or anything. I don't know why he would, but um, anyway. Uh, and we see him go for the Article Crash. So good switch, good switch. Um, should do about 18 to 22 percent. We'll see his item here. Yeah, that looks about right. Um, that's, oh, that's a Life Orb. Yeah, so we see the Life Orb. So that was 18 to 22 for a Choice Band. So Life Orb Weavile. So he probably switches out here. He doesn't. Uh, he, he probably switches out. Um, and to be honest, probably just goes into type null or or into or does he go into Mega Gallade? I'm gonna Thunder Wave because I think that Thunder Wave's the best play. If he wants to go to type null, that's fine. I'm gonna Thunder Wave. And if we miss, <laughs> then bullshit. <laughs> then complete and utter bullshit. Because uh, honestly, if if we got the power on Weavile, then the uh, Weavile's fucked. Like we outspeed it, I assume. I assume we outspeed it uh, with with Toga Kiss. Like we could have just gone for an Air Slash. He does withdraw. See what he wants to go into. Does he go Hard Garlic? He goes Skarmory. So getting the power on the Skarmory is still nice. Is still nice. So the Skarm is paralyzed. Um, and we got we we reveal our leftovers on on Mill Tank. Now, 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 now. Um, what does the Skarmory Skarmory just we probably just he probably just wants to get his rocks up right now. He probably just wants to get his rocks up right now. Um, level fifty Skarmory. Yeah, I do I do nothing to him. I do nothing to him. So. I'm just going to go out to Electros. I'm just going to go out to Electros. I want to keep that momentum. We could both get our rocks up. I'm pretty sure he'll just go for his rocks here. Yeah, that's fine though. Uh, we don't have any removal. We don't have any removal. But, um... It's not, it's not a problem. It's not a problem. Now, I think... I think he doubles out here. I think he goes into Decidueye. So I'm just going to go for a Flamethrower. 
I'm gonna go for a flamethrower. Uh, I wish I'd calc that first, to be honest. I wish I'd calc that first. Um, we'll see how much it does. Electros. Custom set. Um, against the Decidui. Level 50. Oh, that is not <laughs> level 50. Um, so, depending on the set, um, I assume it's a special defensive set, but I don't know. I don't know. Um, actually, given his team... It could be an offensive Decidueye. And a flamethrower, two hit KOs. He does withdraw. Does he go to, does he go to Decidueye? Goes into Titan now. Goes into Titan now, so this won't do much. I could I wish I'd Volt Switched. I wish I'd Volt Switched. I did nothing. Um And I think. I think I do just Volt Switch here. I don't know what Type Null wants to do to me. Um, at level 50. It's definitely a bulky set. It's definitely a bulky set. Um, be it probably especially defensive, I imagine. Uh, means that a Flamethrower did 9-10%, which is probably about right. Um, a Return still does a lot. Jesus, man. A Return still does a lot. Hmm. So, I mean... I think I just Volt Switch. Actually, no, because I don't outspeed, naturally. I am just going to hard switch out. What if he goes for a parting shot? That is like Jock to have the parting shot. I'm just going to go for a Volt Switch. I don't really care about damage on Electros. I, know I outspeed still. I outspeed. So we'll go back and we'll see what he wants to do. I think now he's in range of Garchomp. I think now he's in range of Garchomp. Mm, not quite. Not quite. In which case, I think we just go out to Togabitch. Or we could go out to Scrafty. But if he parting shots, then we're in trouble. If he parting shots, we're in trouble. Um, I think... Honestly, I think... If he parting shots anyway, we're in trouble. What would I have switched out to anyway? I think I'm, I'm, I'm going to go Scrafty. How much does Titan do to Scrafty? Um, nothing. Absolutely nothing. I'm going to go into Scrafty. I say he probably parting shots. He probably parting shots. But there's nothing I can do about that. We take a bit of rocks damage. Intimidate comes in. Do we see the parting shot? Uh, frustration. So that was a good switch from us. That was a very good switch from us. Because uh, we now can actually set up a sub. We can now set up a sub. Um, Skarmory probably comes out now. Skarmory probably comes out. Um, a level 50 Skarmory. Let's have a look. Um, a Crunch does a fair amount. And we can Power Flinch, maybe. Does a, it does 20-24% to a max defense Skarmory. Uh, Drain Punch does just less. And it has the added bonus of getting recovery. Um, I think sub is the best play, to be honest. I think sub is the best play. Because there's no way he switches. He no, there's no way he stays in. And even if he does, we, we live... Um, the, the substitute survives a, a frustration. So I'm really glad we made that switch. I'm really glad we made that switch. <sighs> and uh, we'll see what Joe here wants to go for. Um... We, we, we've got momentum, we've got momentum, but we I know that this game can switch in an instant. He does withdraw. What does he go into? Goes into Skarmory. That's fine. That's fine. 
Uh, he could start stack stacking hazards, to be honest. He could put start stacking, stacking hazards. Um, well, I'm just going to go for drain punches. Get a little bit of health back. Be interesting to know what he actually has. Um, I've, I've just realised I've not been writing moves down. Restration. We saw the icicle crash on Weavile. Silverly Water, we've only seen Partner Shot. Mega Gallade, we've not seen yet. Skarmory is paralysed. We've seen rocks. We've seen rocks, and we're about to see something else. Uh, potentially. The thing is, he can just keep roosting up on me. But it does just let me get health back. But he could stack hazards. He could start stacking hazards, which would be dangerous. Move of draws. And goes down to Gallade. Okay. So, this Drain Punch isn't going to do much. Oh, I did quite a bit. Okay. Um. Now, a crunch does quite a bit. A crunch does quite a bit. I'm going to go for the crunch. I'm going to go for the crunch. See what he wants to do. If he wants to set up a sub, that's fine. I'm just going to go for the crunch. Hmm. I mean, it's a weird switch. I wasn't expecting him to do that. He mega evolves. And what are we going to see here? We're going to see the sub. We're going to see the sub sub bulk upset that Jock loves to. Let me see. Goes just goes to the drain punch. Goes to the drain punch. Um, so my substitute fades. And we'll see how much... Oh, he gets health back. That sucks. Hmm, okay. Right. Drain punch now. I have no, I have no way of knowing how much that did. Is the only issue. I have no way of knowing how much that did. 52 to 63. My calcs say. This is what my calcs say. Ah, uh, that's a minus one. No, 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 no. That's a minus one. Right, okay. We. I think we got to switch out. we got to switch out. And we just go Togabish. We go Togabish. Um, because we should live. I, I need to start calking, man. I'm not calking. I'm just deciding. I'm using my gut. Um, which some people might say is a good thing, but I need to be calking. Uh, because the Zen headbutt would work. That would be mad predictions if he does. If he does decide to go for that. So we switch out into Togekiss, which will take 25% from rocks. And we see the Ice Punch. Good prediction, my friends. Good prediction. Um, very nice prediction indeed. Uh, does he outspeed me? Probably. He's probably max speed. Um, ice Punch. Very, very nice. I should have predicted that really, considering we do have a Garchomp and a, Fe and a Togekiss on our team. Um, But I am just going to air slash in the, in the hope that we outspeed for some odd reason. Uh, Togekiss goes down, unfortunately. So um, that is pretty bad for us. That is pretty bad for us. Um, I have no way of knowing how fast he is. However, how much do you do to Cloyster? You still do so much. Damn. But, you know what? You know what? I think... I think... <laughs> uh, of course, it takes 25% from rocks. No, okay, so we can't do that. We can't do that. Uh, yeah, because Drain Punch will still kill us. 
Okay, okay, so we cannot do that. I think we have to go... I think we have to go Electros. Uh, he still does a lot to us, man. He still does a lot to us. We are Scarf Garchomp. But he, if we go straight into Garchomp, he'll know that. He'll know that. But I think I have to do it. I think that's all I can do. I think I go Garchomp. I have to go Garchomp. Ugh. So the only thing that might be in my favour is because um, how long I took, maybe he'll be thinking, oh, I don't know, maybe he's bluffing. Maybe he's bluffing uh, a scarf. Uh, it's a dangerous game. I just realised I got rid of his Mon 3. <laughs> I just got realised my Mon 3 gone. Um, It's a tough one. It's a tough one. I think... I'm tempted to go for a double, though. I'm tempted to go for a double. So I think he goes Skarmory, because I think there's no point in him risking Gallade. Oh, I'm going to go Electros. This could work out well, or it could work out badly. He... He, uh, he knows that we outspeed him now. Or unless he stayed in. Yeah, he does withdraw. So he knows that he knows that we're scarfed. He knows that we're scarfed. He does go out to Skarmory, so but it does end up being a good play. It does end up being a good play for us. Um and I am just gonna go for a Volt Switch. I'm just gonna go for a Volt Switch, even if he wants to bring in Decidueye. Even if he wants to bring in Decidueye. Um, if he does want to bring Decidueye, I can just go hard Scrafty. So that was a, that was a nice double. These, these are the doubles that are keeping us in the game. Um... It's just his offensive threats, man. As soon as he gets in the Gallade or the Weavile, it's 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 difficult. It's difficult for us. Um, he does go. He goes out into the type now. So that's really that's absolutely fine. Because again, we can just Volt Switch, and we can bring in Scrafty. We can bring in Scrafty for free. We can bring in Scrafty for free. We get the Intimidate off. And if that did a little bit more, if that did a little bit more, there's no reason not for me to sub, I think. No reason for me to not to sub. Because it gives me a free attack on something, even if he goes Skarmory. Even if he goes Skarmory. We are at like two points over half, I think. Three points. What's half over 171? 135.5. So we sub up. He stays in, which is interesting. Frustration. I don't think that. I don't think that will knock out the sub. No, doesn't knock out the sub. So now we can just go for. A, we can just go for a drain punch, and there is no reason why not to. Absolutely zero reason. I think he just goes Skarmory. It's smart players to go Skarmory, or he goes Decidueye. But then, even then, he's he's not gaining anything from doing that. You know, he's not gaining anything from doing that. I would like to a quick click knockoff, but I think the Mega. I, oh no, I don't have knockoff. I don't have knockoff. I have Crunch. I have Crunch. He knows that he can't bring the Mega Gallade in. Uh, he just stays in. 
He just stays in. Uh, let's me take out the type now. Um, and I don't know what he goes into now. I don't know what he goes into now. I'm glad to get rid of that bulky thing. I'm glad to get rid of that bulky thing. Yeah, we'll get rid of it on his side as well. Mon four. Uh, so we are at five. All with 33 minutes of the match remaining. Uh, we are in a... It's an, it, 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 the match is still hanging in the balance, I think. We do still have our Scarf Garchomp. Um, we do have still have Cloyster, which once, I think, once... Uh, Skarmory is a bit lower. We can set up Cloyster. We should probably do that calc now, so that we know exactly how much damage we need. Um... Cloyster against Skarmory. Um, at plus two. A plus two and Icicle Spear does 78% max. So, I mean, if, if we went for one Drain Punch... It goes Gallade. There's Gallade. I'm pretty sure Gallade dies. I'm pretty sure Gallade dies to a crunch. I'm pretty sure Gallade dies to a crunch, man. He goes to the Drain Punch. Obviously, that speeds. Oh, no, no, because we'll get HP back. Can I work out how much HP he ha he's doing from how much he's getting back? I don't know how it works with subs. He's not getting much back. Oh, it's because there was nothing of the sub, of the sub left. Crunch doesn't quite kill. Doesn't quite kill. If we had sucker punch right now, that'd be kind of clutch. If we had sucker punch right now, that'd be kind of clutch. Um, but we don't. <laughs> but we don't. Uh, I do need to save this, but he can just go for another drain punch. He can just go for a Drain Punch. I wish I had Sucker Punch on this. Wish I had Sucker Punch. I'm just going to go Electros. I have to. It's all I can really do. Because uh, this thing just gets... He, he, he Drain Punches and he gets back up, man. This is tough. This is very, very tough. Um, there's, there wasn't anything else I could do there. It does a lot. It does a lot. Uh, and we are just going to give him the free, the free kill here, I think. Um, I'm just going to throw off a Toxic in case he decides to do something weird. Oh, and no, I'm just going to throw a Flamethrower in case he decides to do something weird. He probably just drain, he just drain punches again gets the kill. Um... And I I now go I go into Garchomp. I now go into Garchomp. Um, really disappointed that Electros had to go. Um, I do have to go into Garchomp now. I do have to go into Garchomp. And you know what? I think I just outrage. I actually think I just outrage. Because... If he does go Skarmory, then we get decent damage off Garchomp, um, our custom set. Um, I think I just go Garchomp and I just Outrage, man. Uh, I mean, already, I'm already Garchomp. I'm already, I've already done that bit, um, thinking way ahead of myself. Uh, and honestly, I just click Outrage right now. I just click Outrage. He withdraws. Probably go Skarmory. Yep. Um... But that is fine. That is fine. Um, however, he can't. Oh, he can just roost, man. He can just roost. I didn't even think of that. I just. I'm. I'm, I'm committed now. I am committed. Um, why does Garchomp say thrash? I don't know. Um, he says he probably just roosts up. 
Uh, I know that would be the smart thing to do. Uh, I guess <laughs> he gets paralyzed. He gets paralyzed. Um, so this could be interesting. <laughs> this could be interesting. Um, we got to go for another outrage. Can we get a crit or something, maybe? No. Goes down to less than half. Uh, but there's the confusion. And he just does go does just go for a roost. Uh, it's very, very tough, guys. It's very, very tough. Um, because I, I completely forgot this thing could just roost up. Oh, I completely forgot this thing can just roost up. Um, I'm just going to go into mill tank. I'm just going to go into mill tank. And possibly just thunder wave. See what we can get a thunder wave off on. But he, he could start stacking hazards right now. He could start stacking hazards. Um, which would it would be game over at that point? I think it would be game over. Um, it is a common strategy used against me. I won't lie. It is a common strategy used against me. Uh, just because um, I, I kind of panic. <laughs> um, I do kind of panic, uh, and I am prone to not bringing enough hazard removal sometimes. Um, I don't know. I don't don't know what's what he's thinking. Sort of what his kind of. Uh, his thinking is behind what he's going to do. I think he just surely just stays in with Skarmory. Um, obviously, we switch out into the other guy. And do we start seeing spikes coming out here? No, he withdraws. Tell me. Don't tell me he went, he went Silver Alley. Okay. This is actually okay, because he can just go for a parting shot. He can just go for a parting shot. Um, I am... I'm just going to go for the Thunder Wave right now. I'm just going to go for the Thunder Wave. He probably predicts me to Thunder Wave. Um, he could go... He could go straight back into Skarmory. He could. It's a, it's a tough call. It's a tough call. Um... For him to make sort of, I don't, I don't know much about Silver Valley, man. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have a look at Silver Valley. It's a bulky mon. It's a bulky mon. Um, how fast is Silver Valley actually? Is he base ninety five? Yeah, he's base ninety five across the board. Hmm. Uh, Joe is taking his sweet time here. I mean, uh, I don't know why. Surely he's not trying to timer stall me. Surely not. Like. I'll, I'll keep an eye on it next time. He does go for the part for the parting shot. And the, the, the safe thing for him would just be going Skarmory. Uh, nothing gets paralysed. Uh, he, especially now in parting shot, he takes anything, any attack I want to give. Yeah, he does just go Skarmory. Uh, which is annoying. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, mate. Oh, mate. Lads. 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 I dropped my fucking DS. I dropped my fucking DS. Let's hang on. Let's just let's just get rid of this right now. And let's let's be fucking real. I dropped my fucking DS and the game card came out. So uh, guys, there is hope after all um after talking about it, we decided to try and recreate it on Showdown, and we've done it to the best of our ability. Um, there, there, there is a, uh, there is not much hope. I will say that. 
There is not much hope. Um, I'm just going to get my rocks up. I'm just going to get my rocks up because uh, I need to be let getting the chip off, which I haven't been getting. Um, which, yeah, I probably should have done it earlier. Um, so yeah, we have, we have recreated this on Showdown. Um, I I really couldn't be bothered, but I thought just it, it would be a shame to let it end that way. Um, hopefully this doesn't take too much longer because this is a long video as it is. This is a long video as it is. I'm down to be as quick as pos if you are. Because <laughs> I just want to get this done. Um, I want to go do things because this uh, I've got work tomorrow. So, um, but yeah, <laughs> I mean, uh, it, we're fine losing battle. I, I I don't know why we're we're bothering. There is a chance that we can set up cloister. Um, an iron head would hurt, but we just have to get cloister in on. Well, <laughs> okay, so he goes to Sidroy. He goes to Sidroy. Um, he knows that we're thick fat from his ice school crash earlier. Um, but that's absolutely fine. I'm just going to go for a Thunder Wave. If he wants to go for a Toxic, that's fine. Actually, no, wait. In case he Spirit Shackles me. In case he Spirit Shackles me. Um, I'm just going to go Scrafty. I'm going to go Scrafty. The Intimidate comes in. The Leaf Blade. Crit. The Mago Berry comes in. Right. Now. Now, I think we just go for a Crunch. I think we just go for a crunch. We could sub, but I think we just go for a crunch. Because with Mega Gallade being where it's at, on 60%, it'll take 6% from rocks. If we get lucky with a crit, <laughs> if we get lucky with a crit, uh, then we could be in business. I'm sure he doesn't just switch Mega Gallade in, though, on a, on a crunch. Do you know what I mean? Um, that has been the only crit of the game, though. I will say that. That has been the only crit of the game. Uh, that's why this this was quite easy to recreate. We didn't recreate it exactly. We just um, got it kind of... That's why we have four... I have four mons and he has five mons. Because um, I only brought the four mons that were still alive. Uh, he, he's got a... He's got to try and find a crunch switch in. I suppose, um, uh, which is his Skarmory, which is his Skarmory, uh, we get the defense drop, which is nice, and we can just drain punch, we can just drain punch, yep, he, I know we outspeed him, we outspeed him, honestly, he probably, oh, he probably goes Mega Gallade, man, I'm gonna go for a crunch, I, th I think I could go for another crunch. Question is, how much does an Iron Head do? That is the question. Um, I need to get my Pokemon Calc up. Pop it over here. Um, Scrafty, Straight Edge. Oh man, honestly. I could sub. But I don't think that's a good idea. Oh, how much does Nine Head do? Let's have a look. Skarmory. Physically defensive. Level 50. Um, Iron Head does 12 to 14. No, no, I need to put in a plus one. Uh, 18 to 21%. So I'm just going to I'm just gonna go for another crunch. Uh, he stays in. Uh, he gets, we get the power. That is nice. Come on right now. Now. I'm pretty sure we can just go for a drain punch. He cannot afford to switch out. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know if he can. I don't know if he can or not. I don't know if he can or not. Um, 
Gallade, Mega, Swords Dance, plus one attack. Uh, he's not close combat, he's Drain Punch. Um, and level 50, he does a lot to me. <laughs> he does a lot to me. Thing is, a crunch doesn't take him out though. Uh, he could go for. He could quite easily just go for roots. I'm just going to drain punch. He lives. We get a bit of health back. Oh, the double para. Oh, oh. <laughs> uh, okay, okay. We got a game on. We got a game on now. We've got a game on now. Skarmory. What are you saying? Once again, Iron Heads. Uh, level 50. That does about 20%. I could sub, but I, could, I don't want to give him a chance to roost. I need to get rid of this thing. I'm just going to go for the crunch. Skarmory goes down. He just brings in Mega Gallade now. He does just bring in Mega Gallade now. But now his his Garchomp switching is no more. His Garchomp switching is no more. So we could be getting really fucking lucky right now. We could be getting really fucking lucky. We could be getting really fucking lucky. Um, I think he has to go Mega Gallades. He has to go Mega Gallade. And I think at this point I can kind of sack this off. How much does a Mega Gallade... Oh, I can't spell. Galada. Mega. Swords Dance against a Garchomp. How much do you do, Drain Punch? How much do you do? Drain Punch. Level 50. Uh, Drain Punch still does a lot. 41 to 49. So I can't switch in. I can't switch in. Uh, do I live? I don't live. There's no way I live, is there? There's like no chance that I live. Um, I think I just go for a crunch and hope for the best. <laughs> I think I just go for a crunch and hope for the best. He goes for the bulk up, man. And I'm just going to crunch again. He goes for a drain punch, which kills me. He gets quite a bit of HP back. Uh, yeah, this isn't good. At plus one defense, he's at 63%. An outrage doesn't kill. An outrage doesn't kill. Uh, I think that's GG. I think that's GG. Um, can Mill Tank take two drain punches? Oh, no. There's 63. There's 63. Um, I do have to just go Garchomp. I do just have to hope and pray for something magical. We are just going to click Outrage. We are going to hope and pray for something magical. We are going to hope and pray for something magical. Um, a crit would be insane. <laughs> a crit would be insane. Um, oh, I just realized I need to take Scrafty off the layout. Sorry, Scrafty. You're just chilling there. You want to go home, man. I understand. So do I. So do I. Um, uh, on the bright side, we have got the differential down to four, which is obviously better than... He switched out. I think he fucking choked, man. I think he fucking choked. No, he probably just goes Weavile and probably... 
Maybe ice. I think he choked, man, though. I don't know about that. Mon 5 goes down. Um, as did Mon 3. Down to a 3 0 differential, which is much nicer. Um, if he would he would have gone. I don't think he has the ice shard. I don't think he has the ice shard. Question is, does he just part in shot with the Sil Valley? Does he just part in shot with the Sil Valley? Honestly, I think I go mill tank. I think I go mill tank. If he part in shots, yeah, he part in shots, uh, and probably just goes. He he probably goes into Gallade here, obviously. Obviously goes into Gallade. Part of me wishes I stayed in with Garchomp and just out went for the outrage, but then I would have been stuck. I would have been stuck. Uh, he does just go into Gallade. Now, do I Thunder Wave? Do I Thunder Wave? I think he just bulk ups and he wins. But I'm gonna go Garchomp. I'm gonna oh, fuck it. I'm gonna go Garchomp, man, because I think now's my best chance. I have to go. I have to go hard to Garchomp. Wait, wait, wait! Ice Punch. Ice Punch is a thing. Ice Punch is a thing. Ice Punch is a thing. I compl I almost forgot that Ice Punch was a thing. Oh man. Um. I think he expects me to Thunder Wave, though. I don't think he thinks I'm real enough. I don't think he thinks I'm real enough. And this is the only way I win. This is the only way I win. If I stay in with Miltank, if I stay in with Miltank and let him bulk up, then I lose. If I go in with Garchomp, then I still have a chance. I'm going to go Garchomp. Or if, I, or if he Drain Punches and he gets more HP. Oh, no, but if he Drain Punches, he's still going to get more HP back. Ah, uh, but if he drain punches, then um, he doesn't have the plus one, so a a um, an outrage kills. Gachamp, Gachamp, Gachamp. Custom set. At plus one, I have a chance to kill, unless yeah, yeah. At plus one, I have a chance to kill. Um, right, I'm gonna switch him. I'm switch him. What's he gonna do? Ice punch, drain punch. 40%. Puts him at 84. That's still in range. Rough skin 72. That's definitely in range. We are, we outrage right now. We outrage. We outrage. We outrage. We outrage. Now, this. This is going to be interesting. This is going to be interesting. Actually, I could Earthquake. I could actually Earthquake. How much does Sil Valley Water want to take from an Earthquake? Uh, no. Outrage does more. After rocks as well, I have to go for the outrage. I have to go for the outrage. Dude, I think this is going to be close. This is going to be... I don't know if it's going to be close. I don't know if it's going to be close. If he was real, he went ice punch today. If he was real, he went ice punch. Because... Miltank did nothing to Mega Gallade. He switches out into Still Valley Water. Uh, this outrage should uh, doesn't fuck me. That didn't kill. Um, is he? No, he can't be Scarf. He can't be Scarf. I outrage. I outrage. Still Valley Water goes down. Still Valley Water goes down. Goes Weavile. Does he have the Ice Shard? Yeah, he has the Ice Shard. However. However. 
I assumed he didn't have the ice shot, because why, he, why wouldn't he go for it before? In case I was Yachi, he knew, he knew I couldn't be Yachi, because I was a uh, Scarf. He knew I was Scarf early on. Um, can Cloyster come in here and set up? I think it can. I think it can, you know. Who's Lifehawk? How much does a low kick do? 68 to 80. Oh, that's a roll, and that is a roll in our favour. I'm going I'm going cloister. I'm shell smashing. I'm going cloister and I'm shell smashing. No! That's a roll, man. Wait, unless hang on, wait, unless he's adamant. If he's adamant, then it's not a roll. I wanna know. I wanna know. Are you adamant? <sighs> if he is adamant, that's a roll. Um, if he if is adamant, that was a roll. Um, well, we did get it down to a 2 0, which is fine. Are you adamant? Yeah. Okay, he is adamant. He is adamant, so it wasn't a roll. Yeah. Fair. Um, low kick didn't quite kill. Does a body slam kill? No, oh, it doesn't kill. Wonder if that was a roll. <laughs> it was a roll. That was a min roll. That was a min roll. GG, man. GG. Uh, thanks for replaying. Oh! One nil differential, nice. Okay, one nil differential. Honestly, it sucks because both our losses have been one nils, rightly or wrongly. Um, rightly, or wrongly because the last week was bullshit. <laughs> uh, this week I was a diddy idiot. Uh, I got lucky. I got lucky, man. I got lucky. Be lucky. Ah. Uh. Um, but, uh, yeah, I mean, th thanks, I've got to say thanks to Joe for allowing me to kind of replay that, not replay it, but recreate it, and get that differential down from 5 to 1. Um, we did get very lucky with those paras on the Skarmory. This has been a very, very long video. Uh, you both had some luck, yeah? Yeah? Um, you both had some luck. But, uh, it was a fun game, it was a really fun game. Um, glad that we didn't get to battle Jock, um, because I don't know, I've never seen Joe battle. Um, happy to, happy to see that you can beat me. So he definitely deserves a place on team memes. Haters will say everyone deserves a, t a place on team memes for that reason, but it's not true. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. I've been Dan K Memes. If you enjoyed today's battle, then go smash that like button down below. Make sure you subscribe to myself and to Jock. Um, I assume this is going up on his channel. I assume he'll do a post of it. I hope. Uh, and uh, make sure you go check out the rest of the coaches as well. Um, there's been some absolutely fantastic battles this week. And uh, we'll see you next week, where I'm not sure who we play, but we play someone. Peace.